Hey, this is Steve with Dabble Lab. In this video, we're gonna build a skill that uses the video app interface. And this would be a skill that is targeting either the Amazon Echo Show or the new Echo Spot. And so the video app interface is used to uh, stream native video files to uh, a skill or to the, the show or the dot. And so we're gonna build this skill actually from a template that I created. I've been working on another project that I'm hoping to launch soon called skilltemplates.com. And this is just a repository for templates that work with the, um, the Alexa Skills Kit CLI. So I will start by just showing you how to get to the template and then we'll dive into the code. So um, to, to do this, if you want to follow along, you're going to need the Alexa Skills Kit uh, command line interface installed. And if you don't have that, I'll leave a link to a video where um, I walk through installing that. But um, let me increase the size here first. But if you've got the CLI installed, what you do is you just say ask new, and then we're going to use a template. So you'd go dash dash template like that. And then we're going to use a template from the um, skilltemplates.com site that I'm setting up. So we'll go http colon slash slash skilltemplates.com and then slash templates.json. Just like that. I've just got a couple of them up there right now. I've got a, a basic starter template and this video app starter, which is the one that we're going to be working with today. So you would just select the video app starter template. And then that is going to create a skill project. So I ran that from this folder here, this temp folder. And so it created this project folder called video app dash starter. And from here, um, actually, it's ready to go. So if you've used the, uh, the ask CLI before, you could at this point just go um, ask deploy. And provided that you've got an account with developer.amazon.com and an AWS account and your uh, ask CLI is configured properly, that is all you would need to do to deploy this. So you would just go ask deploy. And this is, oops, I got to change, change into the directory. So video app starter, and now we can go ask deploy. And this will deploy the, uh, the skill and uh, push out the Lambda function also. And so this is gonna take a minute, so I'll pause and come right back. Okay, so now that the skill's deployed, um, I'll just go ahead and test it out to show you what it does, and then we can dive into the code. So here's what it does. Okay, now let's test it out. Alexa, start video app starter. And there you can see it's just playing a simple video from the um, uh, video file that I've got hosted on S3 and it's using the video app directive so it's got all the video controls built in also so I can pause and stop and start Alexa stop and that's it now let's take a look at the code okay so let's take a look at um, what the template deployed and then we can let's see then we can look at the code also. So if you go to developer.amazon.com and um, go to your Alexa skills list, log in there and then go to Alexa and then uh, Alexa skills kit here and it'll bring up a list of your skills. You should see the video app starter skill installed now. And what you'll need to do is go in here and enable it for testing first if you want to test it yourself after you deploy it so if you try to test it and you get a message like i couldn't find that skill or something like that it's probably because you haven't enabled the testing um, the new test simulator won't work with this skill because it's got video in it and the um, the test simulator doesn't support video yet i'm sure it will shortly but it doesn't right now so we would just test it just like we just did using your actual device. So like a, an Echo or a, um, yeah, an Echo Show or an Echo Spot. 
But let me show you the uh, the code and just uh, quickly like what's going on in here. So this uh, this template defaults in the skill manifest with um, the skill name video app starter, and you'll probably want to change that and all of this information here, the summary, the example phrases. Uh, I've also pointed out the um, the icon, the small and the large icons for the skill out to some default images and an S3 bucket that I set up. You'll probably want to change that if you're going to publish this skill for your own use. And then also down here, you'll want to change the um, uh, URL for the privacy policy and the terms of use. But the rest of it should be set up and ready to go. Uh, let me see, what else will you want to change here? In the um, models, you'll want to change the invocation name. So if you go to models and then um, the invocation name up here defaults to video app starter, and you'll want to change that to whatever invocation name you want to use. And the invocation name is the name that starts the skill up. So Alexa start whatever invocation name would, would go right here. And at that um, point, you can dive into the code if you want to take a look at the, uh, the skill. This one is uh, pretty simple. The, um, I'm using a, uh, a video from pixelbay.com and using that under Creative Commons. Pixelbay is a great place to get videos, by the way. You can go out there and there's all kinds of, uh, of good videos. And, and this one is just a relaxing video of a brook or a stream or something like that. But maybe for the holidays, you could have a fireplace video or something like that or whatever video you want. But all you would need to do is get the video that you want and then change out this URL right here. So um, this is gonna point to wherever the video file is that you're gonna be playing. And then the, the meta information up here is the title of the video that's gonna show and the subtitle. So that gets passed into the uh, response template here and you can change those up and then up here the uh, the title I've got a, uh, a template um, screen that's being pulled up that's just showing a, a blank blue background by default you can change this image out if you want to uh, change it up and uh, change the title of the uh, um, the, the first screen that shows. And then also, if you want to change the text, you can change that here. But again, this is a really simple uh, video skill. Hopefully, this provides you with a starting point if you're working on your own skill. If you've got any questions or comments, you can leave those for me and I'll respond just as soon as I can. If uh, you did find this video valuable, please like it and subscribe to the Dabble Lab channel. Thanks so much.